Hi guys, my name is Victoria Pavlov and we will talk today about Adobe Photoshop Sketch. Uh, Adobe Photoshop Sketch has a um, latest update and I'm very excited about this update. Uh, let me First of all, let me show you my few um, projects I created in Adobe Photoshop Sketch. This is my puppy. This project I created using three um, Adobe mobile applications, Adobe Photoshop Sketch, Adobe Photoshop Mix and Adobe Photoshop Fix. Also, this um, a project I created using uh, Adobe Photoshop Sketch paint brushes, uh, watercolor paint brushes, uh, those uh, as well. And uh, this uh, project I also created uh, in Adobe Photoshop Sketch and I uploaded a step-by-step -step, uh, video uh, on my YouTube channel. First of all, let us uh, start. Uh, I will show you uh, my favorite um, update, latest, uh, my favorite uh, features from uh, the latest update. Let me open my project. This is my puppy. And as you can see, now we have layers. How amazing is it? Uh, and uh, the best part of our uh, new feature, layers uh, feature, uh, we have ability to add um, as many drawing or image layer as we want. So example, if we have 20 layers and we want to apply, I uh, use a 19 um, image layer, we can do it. If we want to, if we have 20 layers and we want to uh, use uh, 90 or 20 drawing layers, we can do it as well. Um, uh, if you want to add any layer, just simply click on a plus sign and you will see a um, pop-up menu from uh, you can use um, image layer or drawing layer. Uh, I would like to apply a few um, final uh, steps to my uh, puppy and I want to use drawing layer. So click on drawing layer and and guys, do not forget about this. This is very important. Uh, you can rename your layer. Simply click on your layer and now uh, by default uh, we have a sketch layer if we um, created a drawing layer click on this layer and we will rename we will rename it like test done you can uh, change opacity of your layer you can uh, transform your layer as you want to click no we, we cannot transfer it because I need to um, to do something with this layer first. Um, you can duplicate, merge down and delete. And also you can restock your uh, layer. Click on your layer and bring layer down or bring it on top or bring it between any other layer. I want to bring this my layer on top of any other layers. So, and um, we have uh, new uh, brushes, paint brushes. How you can choose paint brushes? Simply click on um, a, a brush icon, and you will be able to choose a brushes um, default Adobe Sketch brushes, or you can use uh, your own brushes from your library, or or you can create a brush directly from your Adobe Photoshop Sketch application. If you will click on um, plus sign in here right top uh, corner of your uh, brush panel, you will be redirected to Adobe uh, Capture CC where you can create your brush and you can specify uh, you want to create brush for Adobe Photoshop CC or for Adobe Photoshop Sketch. Just because uh, we are working with Adobe Photoshop Sketch and we are creating brush uh, from our Adobe Photoshop Sketch application, makes sense to create a brush for Adobe Photoshop Sketch. Uh, also, uh, now with uh, the latest update, you can control each brush separately. This is amazing, guys. Simply click on this icon and you have all sliders. Um, you can control your brush with, you, you can control uh, size, you can uh, control pressure, uh, you can uh, control flow, and now you can control velocity of your brush. This is very important flow also you have a um, blend mode I want uh, to use normal blend mode right now 
and if you uh, apply any changes to your modification mod modification to your uh, brush and you don't like it you simply can reset your brush clicking on reset button also what you can do uh, you can uh, change a uh, flow of your brush flow is simply opposite of your brush and you can brush a, you can change a size of your brush flow and a size um, also you can choose um, pick color choose color from um, color wheel or RGB or a history uh, it's a history is um, all colors you use um, with this project I want to use a wheel for now and so I can choose any color I want to so any color but if I want to choose color uh, specifically uh, from uh, my project I will click on uh, my color icon and I have wheel I can bring or uh, at any part of my uh, project and I will choose color out of my uh, project so I will bring flow up size a little up and I will pinch and zoom in my image and I would like to apply to draw another eye of my puppy I will make my brush bigger and I will bring just like that I can do anything I want to and guys just because uh, now we have all layers uh, necessary to work with uh, any project I will click on my layer and I will bring opacity of my layer down also we have transform button we can do anything we want we can click and change um, position of our layer we can uh, flip horizontal flip vertical or flip or fit to view so right now i need just to change position of my uh, eye just simply click and drag to any position you want to so i will click on here done and voila let me zoom out and as you can see right now we added uh, extra uh, another eye to my puppy and uh, if I would like to add another layer simply click drawing layer and I want to bring this layer um, behind my all layers click and drag one second yes hmm drag and now I will change my um, paintbrush I will use a um, watercolor paintbrush I will bring size down I will uh, make a shade darker I will choose a darker shade and I will just paint if I want to make my uh, brush bigger I can do it at any time and just because um, we are working with a separate layer and I brought this layer uh, behind all my other layers I'm not uh, messing up with my uh, puppy layer or layers let me bring it just like that flow up and like that And guys, this is the latest update of um, Adobe Photoshop Sketch. And and um, what else uh, we have with uh, the latest update? Um, first of all, guys, do not forget about the uh, this icon arrow icon. If you did mist made mistake and you want to come back few steps, come back, simply click and you will be back to as many steps as uh, you specified but if you will click and hold on arrow button you will see drop down menu so if I want to bring back my few steps so I will click and I will bring back my steps also we have timeline 
This is very powerful uh, drop down menu. Do not forget about this drop drop down menu. And if we close our um, project, we be we will be able to uh, edit our project. Uh, I mean, um, edit our project, rename project, duplicate project, and delete project. Edit project. Um, you can uh, copy and paste your pro uh, project to any other project in your Adobe Photoshop Sketch. Guys, this is the latest update of Adobe Photoshop Sketch. This is a very powerful application. You can start your um, painting uh, project using your mobile application. I'm using Adobe uh, Photoshop Sketch on my iPad Pro and I'm using Apple Pencil. So if you want to start your uh, project using mobile application and finish your project using uh, uh, your mobile application, feel free to do it. Also, you can start your mobile your project using your mobile application and you can finish your project using uh, your desktop application such as Adobe Photoshop Sketch. It's, this is um, absolutely up to you. So it's your project, it's your idea and you can do uh, in any way you want to. Okay, guys, this is uh, what I wanted to share with you today. Thank you very much for being with me and I will see you later on. Bye.